if it isn't the little princess of Zebulon. Princess, what's the matter with preparing an icebox? Jimmy Ray, an icebox has no moving parts. My granny could repair an icebox. There's ice in a box. Now, I think you're just showing off your muscles. <laughs> Keep talking, Alice Murphy. I'm curious to see how your mind works. Okay. You remind me of Adonis. You know who Adonis is? I sure do. He's a Greek god. You remind me of him. In fact, you remind me of the myth of Adonis when he repaired the icebox. You ever think you might be too smart for this time? All the time. What makes you so sure? I entered an essay contest in Raleigh. First prize was five dollars. And I won it. Well, what was it about? I wrote about how there should be a rebirth of Southern writers all writing about the Southern way. And that's how we can make our voices known. Well, I don't see how a group of judges from Raleigh could turn that down. They couldn't. I took that $5 and put it toward my college fund. How much you got in your college fund? $5. <laughs> you want a biscuit? I wouldn't mind having a biscuit. Oh, your hands are dirty. You don't want to eat a dirty biscuit. Oh, well. Better feed it to me then. Now, you and I were thinking the exact same thought. You got a little wild cat about you, Alice Murphy. What's that book? Hey there, F. Scott Fitzgerald, his new writer. I know who he is. The Beautiful and Damned. Is that us, Jimmy Ray? Damned if I know. But you're sure beautiful. I finished it. You can keep it. If my daddy sees a paddle, he'll kill me. Read it under the covers. So, who are you going to take to the couple say date? I don't know yet. Well, I'm standing right here in front of you. That's not proper. Are you asking me? Well, I read in a book that sometimes you have to plant an idea in a boy's head. Well, that's a smart book. You're a young girl. You're a sweet girl, you're a man that you think. And you're a girl. 